What's up Tone Hunters? This is Wes with Distortion Pedal HQ. Whoa. And today we're checking out the R-O-U-S pedal by Blakemore FX, or pronounced Rouse. And if you haven't guessed already, it is a distortion pedal. Let's check out the details. All right, here we have the R-O-U-S, or Rouse, or Roos, depending on how you want to say it, made by Blakemore Effects in the USA. And this pedal features the coveted LM308 chip that was a core component of the original Proco Rat Distortion pedal. You can see that it has volume and gain knobs, and they do exactly what you would think they would do. And then there is the EQ controls of bass and treble. What's interesting for this design is that Blake has designed these EQ knobs to be subtractive so that they cut the frequencies they're labeled for. So when you shape your tone, always start with these knobs fully clockwise, then roll them back to cut the frequencies you don't want. The texture knob changes the characteristics of how the pedal clips the signal. It acts a little bit like a mids EQ knob where you get the scoop sound when it's pulled back and then the full sizzle when you push it all the way forward. And lastly, there's this really cool three-way toggle switch that changes the diodes that are used in the clipping section of the pedal. Left, the pedal is using red LEDs for a louder, more open sounding distortion. Center, the clipping diodes are removed from the path, which grants you a fuzz-like gain. And right gives you silicon diodes, which makes the pedal quiet but often with a lot of gain on tap. All right, let's start off with a clean tone with the red LED section side. Boom, boom, boom. And again, the bass and the treble pots are basically like volume, uh, where they cut those tonal frequencies if you have them all the way down, and therefore you'll have no volume have no no signal just coming through so make sure one of them is up the one you want Texture knob again is really acting like a strong mids 
EQ control. Hey, thanks for hanging out with me and checking out the ROUS Distortion Pedal by Blake Moore Effects. Let me know your thoughts and your questions in the comments section below. And uh, what do you think of this pedal? I'll also be posting a link to the full review article on distortionpedalhq.com, as well as some links as to where you can buy this pedal online. Uh, please subscribe, got many great videos coming down the pipe and I want you to get them all. Uh, but most importantly, keep inspired with your tone, and rocking out, and I will see all of you in the next one. Peace.